Now, there are calls tonight for the government to make jobs and growth an absolute priority this year. It's come from a leading figure in the business world in the East Midlands. Meanwhile, the coalition produced its mid-term statement this afternoon, as you probably know, saying that its ideas will get the economy moving. Mike O'Sullivan reports. And some people thought our coalition wouldn't make it through our first Christmas. Two and a half years later, a mid-term review. Tough decisions still needed, they say, to rebalance and to rebuild the economy. Everyone wants things to go in the right direction in 2013. This company in Chesterfield employs 46 people and supplies emergency lighting signs plus nameplates and labels. The construction industry a huge customer. The boss here is a leading figure in the Chamber of Commerce. He told me the government's got to get things moving. We want the government to deliver on what it's already promised but now not in two years down the line. Business it's claimed could get a boost if road repairs and school building jobs were brought forward. We need to make sure that the investment projects actually start running in 2013 rather than some of the long-term jam tomorrow type projects, which are great in one respect, but they're not going to help the economy grow in the short term. Today, the Prime Minister defended the government's record on growth. When you've got recession in the Eurozone, you've got difficulties in the banking system, you've got uncertainties in the global economy, but this is a very pro-business, pro-enterprise, pro-growth government. It's been a stop-start 12 months or so here. Two redundancies in November, followed by a new member of staff. What this company and many others want is sustained growth. Mike O'Sullivan, BBC East Midlands Today, Derbyshire.